Welcome to the NatFL channel. The Miami Dolphins are going to be in the market for a wide receiver but maybe free agency isn't the way to go after all. Consider that the Dolphins will have Devontae Parker, Alan Hearns or Albert Wilson, Preston Williams, and a likely early round draft prospect. That is five players at the position and Miami may not keep more than that. If we also look at Lynn Bowden Jr. as a possible slot guy that makes six players. If the Dolphins opt to keep Jakeem Grant, we are at seven. We haven't touched on Mac Hollins or Isaiah Ford, both of whom are likely not going to return. The big question seems to be on the returns of both Hearns and Wilson. If both are kept, Miami will have more than enough receivers on the roster. They could look to bolster the unit by adding in free agency and many fans would love to see a potential Marvin Jones Jr. or Allen Robinson addition but in reality, the money may not make it feasible. I love the idea of getting better at WR and the thought of adding a Juju Smith-Schuster, Marvin Jones, or a Chris Godwin is exciting. Add to that the prospects in the draft and the Dolphins could get really good quickly. Of course, that means we have to erase some of who we have currently. Jakeem Grant is a potential release. His production hasn't been what Miami should be hoping for in the passing game. Hearns or Wilson Jr. are both potential cuts but one could stay. Hollins did a serviceable job last year but he isn't likely to hang around on the active roster and could be a practice squad player if he is eligible. Same with Kirk Merritt. If the Dolphins starters and backups consist of Parker, Williams, a rookie, Bowden, and either Hearns or Wilson, where does a free agent addition fit in and who gets the axe? Williams has shown a lot of potential but can't seem to stay healthy. Miami can always find room and truth be told, looking at the roster, there is plenty of room to adjust and improve at the position. If Miami wants to go the FA route and the draft route, then I would expect Grant, Hearns, and Wilson to be gone opening up the roster for the two additions. Miami's best option is, in my opinion, the draft. Jalen Waddell, Jamar Chase, Devonta Smith all would make Miami's offense better and there are several other prospects as well that could make immediate impacts on the team. At some point though the Dolphins are going to have to make early decisions with the unit if they plan to sign a free agent and still have the intention to draft a player early on day one or two. If the draft isn't a priority landing for a receiver on the Dolphins roster, then the free agency will be the priority to get better.